Well, now it's time to throw to a woman psychic called Claire. Please applaud Claire. Please sit down. <laughs> sit down. Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. Well, welcome, Claire. Nice to see you. Thank you. I didn't quite understand the, the psycho killer music intro, but... Well, you, you're a psychic, so, we, you know, we thought we'd uh, give you a bit of a treat there, play something different to the usual theme. Yes, well, a psychic and a psychopathic murderer are two different things, though, aren't they? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know that. I know that. Um, Sorry. Claire, no, that's OK, that's OK. Well, why Claire... did you... Why did you play that music then? Well, it's ABC policy. <laughs> now, Claire, um, a psychic, uh, for those folks at home who don't know what one is, please tell us what a psychic is. Right, well, I see into the past, I see into the future, and I'm also in contact with the spirit world. All oh, right, so it does involve murder, which could, <laughs> could, be, could be carried out by psychopaths, so there, there is a link there. Well, now, you're going you're gonna to try and help us uh, help some viewers at home, aren't you? Oh, I'd love to. OK, that's fantastic. All right, well, so let's, let's see whether Claire's psychic powers are what they're cracked up to be, or are they, as her critics claim, a load of crap? We'll take our first caller now. <laughs> Who's on the line there? Uh, Hello? Yeah, Who's yeah. The... yeah, yeah. G'day, Sean. My name's Nick. Hi, Nick. How are you? Welcome to the show. Uh, yeah, thanks. Look, um, yeah, I've just been offered a, a job interstate, but uh, my girlfriend wouldn't be able to come with me, so, you know, should I go? OK, Nick, what I'm sensing here, what I'm seeing, I'm seeing a girl, a young girl. She's a child now. There's, you and your partner have a child, a girl. That's right, isn't it? Yes? Uh, no. <laughs> OK, it is a young child, as I said, so it could easily be a boy. Now, you have a son, yes? No. Right, OK. I've got a ferret. <laughs> it is the ferret female, Nick? No, no. I'm just trying to help. No, it's not. <laughs> Nick, there's a child around you somewhere, Nick, and it's upset. You know what I'm talking about? No, well, look, I haven't got any children. My partner hasn't got any children. No one in either of our families has got children, and, and we don't live near any children. It's just the ferret. <laughs> right, Nick, it's a little clearer now. It is actually a ferret. <laughs> And, and it's, the, it's the ferret that is upset, Nick. It doesn't want you to go into state, all right? So what I want you to do, take the ferret's feelings into consideration before you make any decision, OK? That makes sense to you now? No, it doesn't make sense. I haven't told him yet. <laughs> yes, thanks, Nick. Over and out. All right, our next caller is Leanne. Uh, go, uh, go ahead, please, Leanne. Over. Um, hello. Hi. Uh, Hi, Leanne. Yeah, I, I lost my father 12 years ago and I was just wondering how he might be at the present moment. OK, he's passed over, has he, Leanne? Yeah, yeah, he has. OK, okay look... Yeah, just, just for the folks at home, uh, passed over means what, OK? Well, he's crossed over to the other side. OK, so, so he's gay, OK? <laughs> <laughs> go, go ahead, go ahead, uh, Leanne. Let, let's, let's not joke, Sean. The man's dead, and I think you well know that. So. Leanne, are you there? <laughs> yeah, I'm still here. Leanne... Your father is in the room with me here. He's worried. He's worried about you, OK? There's also some pain there. There's... Now, he's holding his leg. He's... Now, there's an injury there. It's a leg injury. It's, it's something to do with the way he died, OK? So, how... now, how did he die, Leanne? Um, he choked on a sandwich. <laughs> yes. Yes. OK, what, what sort of sandwich? Chicken. Was he holding a chicken leg, Leanne? <laughs> I'm just trying to help. It sounds like your father's uh, worried and in pain. Thanks for your call, Leanne. That's great. OK, and the next one is, is Jack. Hello. Jack, are you there? Uh, hello. hello. Hello, Jack. Yeah, yeah. Yes, Jack, I'm here. Oh, right, sorry. Claire's um, here, Jack. OK, yeah. Um, <laughs> look, a few years back, my, um, my marriage broke up, which, you know, really knocked me about a bit. And, um, you know, I started to drink a bit too much. I, I lost my job and, uh, and a few other things. Sorry. It's uh, OK. Take your time. OK, cheers. Uh, anyway, look, I started gambling after that. I pretty much lost everything that my wife hadn't taken. And uh, any, the, the point is that I've just been diagnosed with an incurable disease and I was wondering if... Claire... Sorry, Jack, I've got a call waiting here. I'll just put you on hold. <laughs> Who's that? Hello? Oh, yeah, yeah, g'day, Sean. Look, look, it's Nick again. Look, I, I, I just remembered I, I do actually have a kid. Yeah, she, she's at the crash, you know, it's just slipped my mind. 